Bureau of Energy Efficiency's Perform, Achieve and Trade PATH scheme has been spearheading India's fight against wastage of energy by making energy-intensive industries more efficient. Floating solar are installations of solar panels on bodies of water such as lakes, reservoirs and oceans. This technology has gained popularity in recent years as an alternative to traditional land-based solar installations, especially in areas where land is limited and expensive. The floating solar panels are mounted on a buoyant structure that is designed to float on the water's surface. These structures are usually anchored to the bottom of the body of water to prevent them from drifting away. The panels are connected to the inverter on land which converts the DC power generated by the panels into AC power that can be used to power the industry. One megawatt peak grid connected floating solar power plant of Udaipur Cement Works Limited is the first floating solar project in Rajasthan and cement industry in India. The project capacity is of 800 kilowatt AC or 1 megawatt DC and the plant generates 1.4 million units of power annually. The savings from the floating PV power plant has been tremendous. The environmental savings in terms of water evaporation has been approximately 8,000 cubic meter per year. The carbon saving has been as much as 1,000 tons per year. Not to mention the financial savings which has been approximately Rs 25 crores in the span of 25 years. The UCW Hell has decided that by 2040, our company will be net zero emission company. And, and why I'm saying this, that today, today we are in a leadership position and uh, the total energy requirement which we have, out of that, about 48% is being fulfilled uh, through renewable sources. And that includes both waste heat recovery system and also solar system, which includes floating solar also. So I believe that net zero emission is the target and, and we are marching ahead uh, towards net zero emission. The floating PV system is convenient to operate and maintain. It is designed in such a way that it is resistant to strong waves or even wind. Plus, it is resistant to corrosion and basically custom-made for various environmental characteristics. A floating PV power plant undoubtedly offers many benefits, like more efficient use of space because floating solar can be installed on bodies of water that are not used for other purposes, such as reservoirs or wastewater treatment ponds. There is increased efficiency as the cooling effect of the water helps to increase the efficiency of the solar panels which can result in higher power output, reduced water evaporation, which can help conserve water resources. The tangible benefits of using floating photovoltaic systems for power generation are many, and it undoubtedly presents a strong case of replication across other such industries in the country. Well, each of these innovations when put into practice is a step towards energy efficient future. And when such innovation becomes more widespread, it is truly a step towards mitigating climate change. Mm -hmm.